Morning YouTube, we're all plowing today. Some people have asked for some more videos of the John Deere 5090R um, out uh, plowing and blowing snow. Um, today we got, I don't know, five, six inches of white fluffy stuff. It's about uh, negative three out, I think. It's not real bad. So I'm going to fire up the uh, 5090R and we're going to just back it out of the barn, uh, blowing away. When you get a snowfall uh, in this kind of cold out here on the farm, um, the snow is just really light so there happens to be about a five mile an hour wind so it's it's gonna be a little tricky here uh, to get to get clean shots without some snow blowing around so to speak the uh, frontier blower uh, we didn't really uh, highlight last time um, I've got a previous video out that shows the uh, the uh, snowway uh, V plow on the front of it more than the blower that's because we just didn't have a ton of snow um, the, the blower on the back is really nice. It's about, oh, from a 5090R perspective, probably about four or five inches on each side wider than the tire. So that works out really good. Um, obviously, it's, it's, it's a two-stage, and this one does have the hydraulics on the um, uh, blower chute, not just for right and left, but also for angling up or down, as you can see there. The nice part about that is, is you can decide how far you want to shoot the snow. When the snow is a little bit more heavy, so to speak, um, I can lift that bevel up and I probably can get 40 feet out of this thing for throwing ability. When it's light like this, um, I tend to keep it a little bit more down so I just don't get a ton of blow. Um, it just makes it easier. It's a good shot there of that big snowway in the front. That, that thing's just been a fantastic blade for us this winter. I love the fact that you can scoop with it. Um, you know, and you can put it into a V and just bust open trails. There's nice shoes on the blower in the back on these um, Frontiers. Uh, I, I like them. Uh, they're very adjustable. They've got about four or five positions. And, you know, with the 5090R, you can put it in a float position so it just rides on those shoes. Um, right now, I, I really don't want to hit my gravel, uh, which is typical for me after a light snow. So I've got it set. Um, on the three point up a little bit. On the 5090R, you can pick how many degrees you want it at. So right now I'm, I've got it locked so that when I drop it down, it's at about 17 degrees and it's actually keeping the feet off the ground about an inch. So I'm probably leaving a, an inch of snow. As you see when I'm backing up here, I can really, really chuck the snow. Um, it can just, I can blow it wherever I want quite easily. And, and, and this is a shot from the cab. So you can see I have really good visibility on this um, on this uh, frontier there there are different model sizes on these guys uh, this is the I think it's the 84 inch so I think it's a SR 1184 I, I don't always remember the numbers folks certainly if, if you want you can um, you know uh, ask me in the comments and I'll put it in but I'm pretty sure it's a it's a it's an SR or um, uh, SB, excuse me, 1184. I know it's hard to read the stickers on the plow too because uh, unfortunately they get a little uh, whitewashed with the snow. Here I'm in one of the back trails that I need to blow open. Where the tractor currently is, there's very little snow and then as I back into it, the snow gets deeper due to drifts. Um, th this thing is fantastic. You know, obviously you can take, you know, well over a 30 inch drift with this thing. Um, so taking, you know, six inches is just a, a toy for this big blower. Um, but I like having it. Um, I'm, I'm not going to not have a blower. Sometimes, like I said, when the snow is heavy, it's just the best way of doing it. So here she is grinding away. And as I come back to the house, folks, uh, as promised, um, give you a shot here of the, the snowway plowing away. I really do like the scoop form of this blade when I'm up at the house. But boy, when I'm breaking open the trails, I, I really like the V. Um, I haven't had a V up until this winter. Um, I've always been able to just right and left slant or straight. Um, the V is so nice because it, it, when you hit really hard snow, it doesn't push the tractor right or left. Um, you don't have to worry about enough speed when you're running up against a bank trying to throw over the bank. The V just keeps you right in the dead center and then you can just come back and do cleanup. Um, I, I really enjoy it, folks. It's been a, a great tractor. So here it is, coming up the driveway here. Folks, we really do always need your support um, by liking and subscribing to the channel. That's how you're supporting us, so we keep putting out great videos like this to keep the farm and the homestead and the family going. So appreciate it, folks. Thanks for watching.